Ladies and gentlemen, we're back. Technically day three, and we are in the thick of it out here in the upstate New York area, Areola. And, uh, Areola. Yep. And Gert's leaving. Bye, Gert. Bye. Seth, so what are we doing out here? We are going to examine some places that I had found some evidence of Bigfoot two years ago. Okay. Um, I haven't been back since then, so. Apparently, I'm walking through a gigantic spider web. My goodness. Oh my gosh, it's all over. Look at this. As Gert just said, <laughs> more spider web. This beautiful, bubbling, babbling creek. Two women. With the same, same camera. Camera kisses. Oh, ho, ho, ho. wow, it smells like your son's diaper. Good. His sister's boyfriend at the time. He was like fishing over here at one point and he heard like noises in, in the trees over here. I remember him saying, I said he saw movement or something. I can't remember the whole, the whole spiel. Man, it's beautiful. This area reminds me of the place we went up to on that mountain. You watch across that bridge and. Oh my gosh, spider webs are literally everywhere. And they're apparently not attaching to you guys, but just to me. Wow. So there was a, what Seth believes to be a Bigfoot nest right here. A couple years ago, you said? Yeah. Now, let's take into consideration here too. Two years is a significant amount of time. Oh, yeah. A lot of snow, a lot of water, a lot of movement. Those yeah. suckers were jammed in there. It was yeah. Weird. But yeah, it was all like in just crazy like formation down there. At that time, there was a clear as bell x place there really loose sticks and there's still another x still placed there it's true these um, sticks here x yeah. and x is in the areas where we find sasquatch activity are very common i mean we saw several last night when we were out doing some squatching this is this is beautiful We're walking on the edge. Oh, oh. kids. That would, that would have been good video, but not fun aftermath. You be careful, Gert. It's like Tennessee down here. Look at that, that's a nice view. Here comes Sethers, little by little. Woo. There's this little building here, and there's a snake right there, just chilling. I literally walk right by him, so I don't know. It's probably too cold. I don't even know what that is. It looks like an itty bitty little anaconda, just the colors of it. Yeah. Maybe not that exact type of pattern, but. He's running a little closer. He's running into random wildlife out in this area. He's, he's not smelling. His tongue's oh. not coming. What? 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 That spider right there. Where? On the door frame. Oh, yeah. <gasps> oh, that my gosh. It. Oh. Dude. I wish you guys could see this, but holy mother, it's like a tarantula. Yeah. Okay, Gert's going in. Oh Tap gosh. on the screen so you can make sure you see it. Oh my goodness. Dude, it's huge. Oh, he moved. He moved. He moved. He's looking at Damien. Hey, bud. Get another close up of him, too. I don't know what that snake is. I don't think he's venomous, though. Brave, brave man, brave Dan the man. Shoot. Yeah, that spider's a lot bigger than you think. Oh. Because you're only seeing like his legs. If yeah. Look around, he's he's every bit of that size. I ain't even. Oh my gosh. All right, 
made it to an overlook. Look at this sexy view. I love Sophia, Bella, Chip, and Mr. Nasty. And also, Kate poops on strangers. Smiley face. Andy DiCarlo was here in 2021 and made sure to let us know he came by. Ride till the wheels fall off. 0103 2022. And Danny Dan Dan. I don't remember where we left off, but here we are, kids. We're back. It's another day. It's a new day. It's a fresh day. And we finna get some brekkie here at uh, Selena's Diner, as previously showcased in another one of my videos. You can see this beautiful piece of artwork. There's the top of Seth's head, and there's the top of Gert's head. Let's go get some food. Thank you. What'd you get, bruh? A quesadilla. Breakfast. A breakfast. breakfast quesadilla. So what's on it? Eggs, ham, peppers, onions. Well, yeah, just tell her to text me to help her. My, what's in your little, mates. your little cups? I got some like sour cream, guacamole, and salsa. <laughs> What'd Gert get? I got some biscuits and gravy. Biscuits? Wow. Biscuits and gravy. That looks fire. Those potatoes look ridiculous. I got Simpleton. I got burger and eggs. And they better not have charged me for a price because I got half my meal taken off. It's bright out here. Same camera. Let me see. Look at it, it's gorgeous. It's another the weather this week has just been fantastic. Hey, there's Jess in the window. Hi. Thank you, Selena's. Charging me $10 for a hamburger patty and an egg. Well, we're back up at North Lake and we've been here several times. Pretty much every time I've been to New York, I've been up in this area. This is the view, it's gorgeous. And we are hiking to Sunset Rock, you said, Seth? Mm -hmm. Sunset Rock. And this is a higher supposedly, point? Supposedly, yeah. It's, the most, it's, it's supposedly a higher lookout point than the place where the old hotel sat uh, that we just recently visited when I was up here a couple weeks ago. So we're going to be doing about a mile, just under a mile and a half hike. And uh, this is how it's starting. And it's a beautiful day. And this is wonderful. The area we're in right now is just filled with little camp spots. And they're so cool looking. Like that's a camp spot. A little too much sun for my liking on that one. Foot trail. Yeah, really. Yeah, this is literally a camping area. Uh-oh. Whoa. <laughs> Have mercy. Wow, who beefed? Holy crap, that stings so bad. I know, I told you. It's like I walked into a baby diaper. Turd just making its way down here. <laughs> wow. Okay, this is literally a campsite. This is the entrance. Look at this. And over here. Oh my. Your tent, your camper, whatever could go here. Oh my goodness. Right by the stream. Oh. <laughs> Oh yeah. yeah, this is, this is ridiculous. And these are other campsites, like this is, my goodness, this is amazing. And the water is so clean and clear. This is neat, guys. This is nifty. Wow. Amazing. Uh, amazing. Yeah, the stream comes over here too. You got this amazing fire pit. So you're literally, you're grilling and then you're next to the stream and then you're eating next to the stream and you're sleeping next to the stream and then you're streaming 
it's only on YouTube next to the stream. You got these rocks you can hang out on and climb on top of. My. Boy, it's giving me a, a bit of a sensation. So bright, I can't even see my screen. How does Allie do this? Right? <laughs> Man. Well, we meandered for a while and tried to figure out where this trailhead was. And although we passed this trailhead before, we didn't realize it was the one that we needed to go on. But we figured it out. So here we are, we're in the thick of it now. Here's Seth. He's lying, we're lost. We're lost. Been out here for nine hours. Wow. It's already 12.50. Listen, I'm sorry, okay? We started at 10.45. 12.50 in the morning. Wow. The nine hours went pretty fast. Yeah. yeah. The last ten hours, the sun doesn't go down. It's literally daylight, 24 hours a day. Like we're in the back rooms. <laughs> Are we in the back rooms? Not the back room. Papa. Boompa. Oh, Boompa. Unka. Unka. Oh, we're definitely over a mile, but I forgot to unpause my my watch when we stopped back there. Look at Seth just traversing these rocks like yeah, like a <laughs> pro, pro, professional. It's like he lives out here. Yeah. Ooh, that jump just now. Woo. Wow, look at pay attention to where we're going. Oh, trail. <laughs> yeah, that's oh, a good point. Okay. We need to be making sure we're following these red yeah, things so we don't get lost. Like... Otherwise, it will be nine hours in and we won't be there yet. We hear a waterfall. Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's called Ashley Falls. Off the mountain. <laughs> Ooh, we get to traverse through some water. Ashley Falls. Let's go up there, eh? What am I, Canadian? Let's see, I'm gonna go wide left. Yeah. There's Seth. Hi, Seth. Hey. A dime. Yeah. Wow. Oh yeah, totally attainable. Wow, this is awesome. Yeah. I'd like to go put my head under that too. I know it, right? It's cold too. Yes, it is. You can literally feel it. All right, here is the path. We got to go up now. So up we go. Again, we got turned around. We're following the yellow trail to Ashley Falls and completely missed this random red trail that goes this way. So we're already getting higher elevated <laughs> and it's hot and we're sweaty top of Ashley Falls right there we were way down there and Gert found a bridge Wow, look at this, that's so cool. Yes, it is, wow.
Still going. May have. Okay. Well, apparently we got 1.7 miles to go. This way. Behind the dam. All right, so we're still on the hike. And we just found this. It's called Bad Man's Cave. So let's head up there, shall we? Congratulations. You found Bad Man's Cave. Oh. Are you an NPC? You found the Bad Man. Are you an NPC? And then he transforms into like this evil beast. Oh, I am the Bad Man. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm being honest, it's a little underwhelming. It's cool though. Yeah. <sighs> it's cool, like cool temperature wise up here too. Yeah. Underneath this rock. Yep, bad man's cave. Oh my, yeah, we are high, kids. Oh, baby. Okay. You can't really tell here, camera kids, but my goodness. Is this the way it goes? Uh, I don't know, because I see a blue one over there. So. Oh, yeah, yeah. So that, we're probably supposed to go up this right here. Yeah, I feel so. We're probably supposed to go that right there. Down. So we just need to oh, go up. Yeah, <laughs> it's fun having different people lead every now and again. Yeah. Holy cow. Oh man. Alright, I don't want to spoil too much here for myself until we get to an actual overlook. Hey, what are you looking at down there? I know, right? We're close. That's a little bit of a drop. Oh yeah. Getting higher and higher. Can you take me higher? Can you take me higher? Yeah. Okay. okay, someone else is gonna have to go first because my scared of heights is definitely kicking in. Oh my. Again, cameras don't often do it justice, but and we're not even to the opening. If this opens wide open, I'm gonna be freaking out. And then Gert does that. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Look at where you're walking. Wow. Okay, hold on. I gotta keep moving. I gotta keep moving. I gotta keep moving. I mean, it's not super high. Yeah. It's just the, Further out. it's just the way the environment is set up. It's just, ooh. <laughs> Gert just yelled yellow and off he goes. <laughs> so the blue dot down there is where the rest of our trail goes. Gert's showing us how easy it is. We're high and we're deep in this sucker. Yep. You can see by the gray, and again, cameras don't showcase height very well and distance very well, no. but we'll just watch Gert get smaller and smaller. <laughs> yeah, none of us are carrying each other back. Gert's a ways down there. I'm talking, we're talking like 20 feet down. Gert's definitely getting smaller. To that tree at the very base, we're probably up three stories. Oh, yeah. 25, 30 feet easy. Keep going, Gert. Go all the way to the bottom and turn around and wave. To show us how small Gert got. There he is. Little Dan. All right, here we go. Well, we're still uh, descending. Haven't gotten a clear outlook yet, but it's it's far, far down out there. We're still trucking, little by little. We passed like, what was it, like six or eight guys with full, full packs and sleeping bags, and I'm the only one that has a backpack on. Oh, Seth has a backpack on too. Yep. But we out here, right, Gert? We out here. 
Jess, maybe zoom up on this so you guys can get a better vantage point out there. But I mean, we're high. I know I keep saying that. I'm just trying to push home the point that we are very high up. And there's like mayflies all over the place. But yeah, we found this thing with leaf growth and a little crevasse, as the Dan said. Let's see if I can get down here without slipping. Without slipping. You're bleeding? I guess. Nice. Oh, hey, a little war wound. Praise the bug. <laughs> Probably. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. You so sharp. Oh, yeah. Oh, shoot. Wow. This has to be Sunset Rock. It has to be. Even though it doesn't say. Wow. Okay. Hey, there's Friar Tuck right there, straight in front of us. Dude. Right in front of us. Yeah. Holy buckets. Holy smokes. Holy smokes. Yep. Wow. We did it, guy. We did it. We did it. We did it, guy. We did it, buddy. Red faces and all. Oh, yeah. Wow. Crazy. Dude, so the other ledge is literally over here to our right hand side. This is a better view though. Yeah. You know what's insane is I could literally launch my drone and fly all the way to the tuck, film around the tuck, wow. fly it back. That crazy. But I don't know if the battery would last. And yeah, that, that idea literally puckers my butthole. Right? Oh, oh yeah. yeah, for Me sure. Too. Wow. It's so much nicer up here with the green colors from a couple weeks ago. Dude, seriously. Dude, oh my goodness. Yeah, we gotta get a photo of this palm for sure. Stay on this rock, it'll be fun. It just takes my mind a bit to get used to this. Holy crap. Yeah, this is more intimidating than the other one. Yeah, it's because there's a sheer drop off yeah. right, right next to it. I can't believe we're straight out at the tuck. I'm like, I wonder if we'll be have a good view of the tuck. Oh man. And it's just silent. And then Greg gets a phone call. <laughs> this isn't even the Sunset Rock. We thought there's a Sunset Rock, but it's not. This is Newman's Ledge. So uh, according to Gert, in order to get back on the trail, we have to go along this edge over here, which, oh, there goes Seth and his drone which is terrifying. Gert's coming back to the report here, so ah, it could be very interesting for me. Kids, we're heading back. We've reversed because we're in a time crunch and we're going back the way we came because the other way, well, to be honest, it's because of my fear of heights and I don't think I could do it with a time crunch if we had all the time in the night. Also, that was Newman's. Right. Yeah. yeah not, not right, it wasn't, sunset. it wasn't Sunset Rock. So that was another reason why I was thinking like, I thought we were further than what we were. Right, and like... Well, I think their markers are off, honestly, because... Well, a lot of it's elevation, too, and if they're just judging by, like, a straight flat distance, 
True, yeah. Yeah, so knowing that we had another ledge to get to and the path continued basically on the ledge. Yeah, there's somewhere you're like two feet from. Yeah, mm -hmm. a sheer couldn't, drop off, couldn't do it. Now, I, I can't say I couldn't do it. Yeah, it's at this moment with the circumstances, I don't want to do it. Well, we got a little bit of a hike ahead of us, so let's let's carry on, kids. Here we go. Well, as you can see, we're no longer in the mountains. Um, if only the commute from the tip top was this quick for us as it was for you. But what we believe to be one mile hike on Google Maps, it turned into a roughly seven and a half mile hike. And we were gone for just over five hours. And we climbed about 800 feet in elevation. Lots of ups, lots of downs, but man, it was awesome. Right, fellas? It surely was. Yeah, so now we're chilling here in the Airbnb. By the way, this is my grandma bed. Right here, this is where I've been sleeping this whole time. Yep. There's there's Sting. There's Blippy. And there's Man Man! <laughs> oh, hey, 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 hey. Video's not done yet, kids. Video's not done yet. Listen, listen. I just dropped a brand new It's All Me merch. And I need to make sure you guys check out the description below for all the details. There's a link. Grab your merch. We got hoodies. We got t-shirts. We got tank tops. We got stickers. There's hats. All sorts of stuff. New designs are going to be coming throughout the upcoming months. So I want to make sure you guys check that out. It's All Me merch. Available now. Don't miss it, kids. It's a great way to support me and my channel and upcoming content. So make sure you hit that description down below. Check out that comment section. Let me know what you'd like to see for future merch. Grab you some and let me know what you ordered. Okay, video's done. You can, you can move on. I'm gonna go back inside.